What is up, Palangga? Thank you for watching this video. My name is GP, and welcome to Diary Nilangga YouTube channel. If this is your first time watching our video, here in our channel, we are giving content for self-improvement, life tips and tricks, and helpful reviews. I'm so excited for today's video, Ma Palangga, kasi we are going to review an air conditioner product, which is Carrier Compact Inverter. So if you're planning to buy a new air conditioner that can save your electricity bill without compromising its efficiency and quality, well, this video is perfect for you. So keep on watching! Hindi natin makakaila mga palangga na mainit talaga dito sa Pilipinas. Kahit nga nakaharap ka na sa electric pan, pinagpapawisan ka pa rin because of humidity. At dahil nga pataas ng pataas ang presyo ng mga bilhin ngayon, karamihan sa atin is ayaw na lang gumamit ng aircon kasi nga naisip natin na malaki yung may dadagdag nito sa ating electricity bill. And I'm so happy that Carrier created this air conditioner which is compact inverter that can save up to 85% of our electricity bill. And before we talk about its benefits and a lot of features, balik Tignan mo natin yung araw na kung saan we unbox this unit. So, let's go! So, we have here Carrier Compact Inverter. And, ano na siya? 1.0 horsepower for window room air conditioner. So, this should be the unit looks like. So, let's go ahead and try to check what's inside the box. Kaya sabi dito, meron na daw siyang remote control and some other features. So, let's find out kano nga ba yung naman itong ating Carrier Compact Inverter. Okay. There you go. So, pagka-open natin ng box, so ito na yung may kita natin. Ito yung kasama niya. So, ito na yun. Um, they have warranty at the back. And, ano na rin siya. Parang kompleto na siya. Nandito na yung manual. How it works. What are the things that we need to check with this unit? Kung paano siya gamitin? Yung mga features niya? So, yun. Napaka-user friend din yung mga palangga. Yung madali mo lang siya may intindihan. And, aside from the manual, they do have as well this. And, um, this is for the remote control holder. So, basically, you're just going to, uh, to attach this to the wall and then will be easy for you to, to place the remote control. So, and the next one is the remote control. There you go. So they do have a remote control for our air conditioner. Ayan. So later, check natin mga palangga kung ano nga ba yung mga features na pwede natin magawa with this um, remote control and also how our unit works. And may kasama na rin siyang battery. Ito yung kanyang mga accessories na nakalagay dito sa taas. And now, let's go ahead and get rid of the box. Madali lang siya mga palangga maano, matanggal. Look at this, di ba? O, lakas ko, no? O, tada! This is now our unit. So, if you will see, um, energy label, air conditioner, Energy Efficiency 4.05 under test conditions. So more stars and higher rating means more savings. A few inches later. And guys, so yun na na install na siya. So basically, meron talaga mga space pa dito. So nagwan na nila ng paraan, pinakpan nila ng styrofoam. And welcome back! So that was more than a week na mga palingga, that we installed this air conditioner. And for the past few days nga mga palingga, that we've been using this carrier compact inverter, I was amazed to discover na meron pa siya mga beneficial feature which is itong eco mode. Ayan. 
and also itong energy saving plug. So with this echo mode map lang itong color green button na makita natin sa remote control. This feature can lessen energy and electricity consumption. Then sa tama pa lang once ginamit kitong button na to, gamitin natin. Ayan. So, magsa-set na to echo mode itong ating unit. At itong unit natin, mga palangga, siya na yung gagawa ng paraan on how it can lessen the electricity consumption. Madaling sa ta, siya na yung nag adjust So, gumagawa ng paraan on how it can reduce electricity consumption. At itong energy saving plug naman, mga palangga, dyan nyo ipa-plug yung electric pan. So, that means to say, mga palangga, kapag sinet nyo ng timer itong carrier compact inverter nyo, let's say for example, 4 hours. After 4 hours mga palangga, automatic magto-turn off na yung inyong air conditioner. And then, automatic naman na gagana yung nakasaksak na electric pan dito sa plug. So, with that feature mga palangga, hindi nyo na kailangan pang bumangon para i-switch yung inyong air conditioner into electric pan. And alam nyo ba mga palangga, that this carrier compact inverter passes 19 stages of quality assurance testing. And to ensure the durability of this product mga palangga, carrier uses quality materials. Una nga dito is yung hydrophilic coating that helps water form from condensation and slides down to prevent mold formation. And it has also full body painted chases, finishing the chases with paint indoor and outdoor to prevent the aircon cover to rust. It also uses thick coils that won't rupture easily in case na merong mataas na pressure. And now, share ko naman sa inyo mga on how it works and its features by using those buttons dito sa actual unit. So, buksan na nga natin siya. So, ito yung kanyang power button. Pag-pindot niya yun, mga palangga. Ayan. At nalabas na yung uh, degree Celsius dito. At meron siyang fan. So, itong fan na ito, mga palangga, ito yung level ng uh, fan na lumalabas. So, yung lamig na lumalabas with this aircon. So, let's say, meron siyang F1, F automatic, F3, at saka F Pero sa case ko, nagay ko lang siya sa F automatic para bahala na si unit kung ano nga ba yung tamang fan na nababagay sa kanya while it is working. And for the mode naman mga palangga, so dyan yung may kita yung cooling mode, dry mode, at saka fan mode. So ayan, so kung gusto nyo naka-fan mode lang siya, or dry mode, or cooling mode, sa inyo mga modes. At yung timer naman mga palangga, so you have the option para mag-automatic turn off itong unit na to. So para, for example, matutulog kayo, so hindi nyo na kailangan pang gumising para patayin yung aircon. So it can automatically turn off on its own. So pwede nyo siya maset mga palangga after 24 hours based sa nagamit ko siya. And dahil nga doon meron siyang itong automatic plug, so kapag sinet yung timer mga palangga at nakaplug yung inyong air, inyong electric pan here. So, once na mamatay ito, mga palangga, automatic magbubukas naman yung electric pan. So, that's the good thing with this timer and also with this energy saving plug. And lastly, first swing naman, mga palangga, so kung gusto nyo mas spread yung lamig throughout of your room or the entire room, so you can spread by, by pressing the swing button para umikot ito. And not only that, you also have the option naman para magalaw itong ano niya. Saan yung gustong direction. So, gusto nyo ma-spread ma over so you can press swing. Pero kung ayaw nyo naman, gusto nyo naka-steady lang. So, you can turn up the swing naman. And ito naman yung kanyang uh, buttons kung gusto nyo pataasin or pababayan yung temperature. When it comes naman sa temperature, mga palangga, most likely laging ginagamit ko lang is around 24 to 25 degrees Celsius. Depende din sa lamig na gusto ko ma-achieve inside the room. Kaya naman, it's really important din, mga palangga, that you need to use the right um, horsepower with your unit na compatible talaga siya with the size of your room. Kasi mga palangga, choosing the right number of horsepower can ensure us na ma-cover niya talaga yung lamig inside or all throughout your room. At sa mga hindi nakakalam kung ano nga bang pinakaiba ng inverter sa non-inverter, yung inverter mga palangga, nag-automatic siya na mag-adjust sa sarili niya. Sana all nag-adjust. <laughs> that means mga palangga, kapag na-hit niya na or na-achieve niya na yung temperature, so kusa siya mga palangga mag-adjust Di bali, parang magfa-fan na lang muna siya para ma-maintain niya lang yung temperature na na na-achieve niya na. And then, kapag feel niya pa rin na parang kulang, so automatic, nag-turbo ulit siya para ma-maintain pa rin yung temperature na gusto niya. And then, kapag na-heat niya ulit, so 
pwedeng bumagal na naman yung kanyang turbo. For having that mga palangga, so it can save your energy consumption. Compare from the non- inverter na kung saan tuloy lang yung turbo nyo even though na-heat nyo na yung kanyang desired temperature pero tuloy-tuloy pa rin yung kanyang turbo so yun naman yung non-inverter at hindi mo naman kailangan talaga pumunta sa actual unit para pindutin yung mga buttons because meron ka namang remote control so with the remote control mga palangga dyan yung mo may kita kung ilang temperature yung may workout ng ating unit tapos mo din mamamodify kung anong mode yung gusto mo at dito nga din makikita yung echo mode yung fan speed, yung pagmamodify ng number ng temperature, yung pagto-turn on and off nitong unit, and yung mga buttons naman sa baba, meron siyang sleep, on timer, swing, turbo, off timer, pal, cycle, and run H. So, yan naman yung may kita natin sa screen ng kanyang remote control. Just to make sure na talagang uh, kung ano yung lumalabas sa paano yung mino-workout na ating unit is nakikita din natin sa remote control without looking to the actual unit. And based from my observation, mga palangga, for the past few days, it works perfectly. Kasi even though 25 degrees Celsius na yung ginagamit ko, it is already enough para makover niya yung temperature na kung saan comfortable ako inside the house. And I'm so happy nga, mga palangga, that I found this carrier, compact inverter. Especially, I'm working from home which I spend my entire day inside my home. With this carrier, compact inverter, mga palangga, I can now have a better indoor air quality without worrying a high electricity bill. And if ever need ko naman ng help mapalangga with this unit, I can still reach out naman with their 24-7 customer service. And para yung mapalangga, lagay ko na rin sa description box below yung kanilang website where you can purchase this carrier compact inverter and also you can follow din mapalangga with their social media. So that's it for now mapalangga. I hope you enjoy watching this video. If you do, please hit the like button. And share nyo din itong video na ito sa inyong mapalangga langga din who's planning to get an air conditioner. At kung may mga questions kayo or anything you want to share, don't hesitate to comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. And if you want more helpful product reviews like this, you may also consider subscribing to this channel and para yung mga palangga, gagawin ko pa siya ng video soon once I receive my electricity bill para mabigyan ko rin kayo ng updates on how it affects and the result nitong unit na ito sa electricity consumption ko. So please make sure then that you hit the bell notification button para updated kayo when I release that video. Again, thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you guys have a fantastic day and I will see you all on my next vlog. Bye!